Well, that's not a lot of fun, is it? So let's raise those elevators again and try it again. Perfect. So now we're almost ready. Let's give it a charge. Remember that when you charge your power up, always have the label facing the ground, the white label. Okay, the propeller will start rotating once you connect the power unit. Count to about 10, and let's give it a short launch. Here it goes. That was perfect. There are three things you need to remember. One is launching heading into the wind, so find the wind direction. The second is the angle of the launch, up, horizontal, or down. Well, you should try all three. You'll see every one gives you a different uh, flight. And the third is how strong you need to launch it. That also depends. So, let's start with wind direction. Find the wind direction. How do you do that? Well, just wet your finger. You'll feel a cool sensation from the wind direction. For example, here it's coming from this direction. So you need to launch it heading into the wind. The second is the angle. Well, if you launch it towards the ground, it may hit the ground, of course, but it will also gain some speed, so that could give it an, an advantage. If you launch it up high, well, that will that's an, an advantage because then the airplane can gain altitude, but it also loses speed. So you'll, you'll need to try and see what works best for you. I like launching the airplane up high and throwing it quite hard. 